Hey guys, today I'm going to show you guys my daily routine for makeup. Let's get started. So the first thing that we're going to use is the Bambin 3 Moisturizer. I have the moisturizer thing. Ugh. I lose that much. And I always do this. I put dots all over my head. Okay, then you are gonna just rub it around. Cause me myself, I do not have an oily skin at all. I have very dry skin. You need to moisturize it a lot. And um, this um moisturizer is very helpful if you have um dry skin. After you're done with the lotion, your face is going to look a little bit red because you just rubbed your face and stuff. And also, I washed my hands before this, so yeah. Then you're going to grab the Elf Professional Foundation Plus. Can't really see anything. But, yeah, it looks like a paintbrush, but I like it. Then, we're going to use the Wet n Wild with Benefits. Um, the ultimate cover foundation, and um, the reason I use foundation, the liquid foundation, my age people don't really use the liquid foundation, they just use powder. But since I have freckles, you can't see anything in the camera, it looks like a pretty clear face, but um. Yeah, I have a lot of freckles and they look very ugly. So that's why I use the ultimate cover one. And this is in the color nude. So yeah, I got this at Walmart. Um and basically what you do open it. Then um it's easier to put it like on top of your hand. So yeah, you just want to dab it here. It's about that much. I just put two little dots. Sorry about the window. There's a bunch of lights in here. Okay. And then you're gonna grab your blush, and you're just gonna take the brush and take a little mm -hmm. bit. Just dab it a little, but you don't like, I don't, I don't like to put a lot at one time, because you never know. Okay, so you're just going to grab that, as I told you, and you're just going to go, um, focus on the spots that you have, that you want to cover. And sorry for the change of lighting. Um... So, I'm mostly going to put it on the top of my cheek because I have a lot of freckles and my um, forehead and my nose. So, yeah. So, you're just going to do it evenly. And by the way, all of the um, brushes um, are from e.l.f. So, yeah. And I got it all together, so. Mm, so, yeah, it looks kind of good. Okay, so you're just going to finish off with the nose. Okay, and then, um... With the fluffy brush, that is a professional total face brush from Elf, and you're gonna grab the Eye Color, the Pressed Powder in the color Nude. So you're just gonna get like a little bit. So 
but you're just gonna get about that much. You're just gonna sh um shake off the excess powder, and then you're just gonna um put it anywhere that you have uh anything that you want to cover. As I said, I have the speckles, so I'm just gonna let me know. And Okay. Then your brush is gonna look like this, pretty clean. And then we're gonna use the eyelid primer. Yay! So this is my first primer, and um, I don't, I don't know. I bought this because I have really baggy eyes, so yeah, but it's a uh, eyelid, eyelid primer, so, and it was a dollar, very inexpensive, and this is also e.l.f., so yeah, and um, what you're going to do, just grab very little, so just take off a little, and then you're just going to make at least three dots if your if your eyelid is a little bit smaller you could just put two and each kind of side so just like that and then you're also gonna put some under your eyes if you have baggy eyes if you don't you don't really need this but I do and also, if you're going to put makeup under your eyes, um, you want to put some of this on too. So, you're just going to put it, you're going to put it, you're going to put it under your eye. And also, I don't know about you guys, but what I like to do I actually did it this morning, um, and it looked very good. So, um, you're gonna put three dots going down your nose, and that makes your nose really stand out. Um, and then you just do that three, and yeah. So, we're gonna blend it in. You could do two ways. You could use this brush that is for eyeliner, but I don't really wear eyeliner, as I said. So you could use this. But I like to do use my finger so it looks more natural. It doesn't really look like you brushed it. So um, you're gonna grab any mirror for this because um, you can't really see my family. So I have this. Mwah mirror kiss mirror and you just slide it open and I want to blind it there I'm kidding okay so grab any mirror and you're just gonna blend it I'm starting I'm starting off with I'm my nose the rest of the face And as soon as you're done, you're going to look very, your whole face is really going to stand out because this is very, um, not white, but it's, um, very illuminating, so it looks like you have light on yourself. It's very good. So, next, you're going to get any eyeshadow. I'm using the LA Color. And this is eye candy. And um, it has a very good colors. Also comes with a little brush. Two sponges. But um, I don't really like to use that. So I use my eyeshadow brush, which I will show you guys in a second. So this has a pink color. 
blue and then like a kind of white color and then we're gonna use this is a bit lighter and then um and um there's a purplish color a pinkish color and another um blue color so this is a very good palette it's a very portable one and then the eyeshadow that i'm going to use i mean eye brush that i'm going to use is the l professional eyeshadow brush you can't really see the name but it's a very good eyeshadow brush i use it for almost all my eyeshadows because it's a very good brush then you're going to start with the eyeshadow so um since i'm wearing this scarf it's purple blue and peach so I'm just going to put a more natural color. I'm going to use this white color and also um, this pink color. So first you're going to get the white. And you're going to get about that much. And put it on your outer corner of your eye. At least half of your eye. And bring it up to your crease. Okay, now we're going to do the same for the other eye. Okay. So, now you're going to add the, the light purple color. And you're going to expand the inner core. The inner core of your eye. So you're going to grab about that much. And then you're just going to dab it. And this is eyeshadow for um, people who don't really like to wear eyeshadow. It's very, it looks very neutral. As you can tell, I'm using a very light color. And then you can bring it down if you want. Just half of the bottom of your eye. And yeah. So you're gonna do the same for the other eye. Okay, just like that. And you're going to want to um, put a little bit of purple on the crease. It looks very good. Okay, then you just try to take everything off of your brush. So it doesn't get so dirty. And the next thing is your eyebrows. And I don't um, paint them. So I just comb them and brush them so they can look a little bit better. Better. So yeah. So you're gonna grab this side of your brush. The the hard side. And you're gonna push everything up. Then you're going to grab the other side, the brush, and you're just going to fix your eyebrows. My eyebrows are pointy. I like them pointy. So, yeah, and if yours are just round, you could just go ahead and do that. I like to have them pointy. So, you're just going to do that. So, you can see, already see the difference. This line is going down, and this is like flying. <laughs> So, and by the way, these are all drugstore products where you go ahead to your closest Walmart or Target and get the best hair. Okay, so you fix this part. And lastly, you grab any chapstick. I'm using the Soft Lips Winter Mint. I got this at Walmart and there's, no really a there's not really a specific store where you could get this at. 
Stockless are almost everywhere. So yeah. And very easy to get. So Okay. And if you want a bit of more pop of color, you can put on colored lipstick or anything. But that's it. I hope you liked the look. Thank you for watching. Mwah. Okay, the next thing that you're gonna do. Okay, it's supposed to catch it to my throat. Oh, <laughs> you hit my head. You're so stupid. <laughs> Ow. You're gonna brush your hair. <laughs> you're gonna no. grab an ear. Oh my god, that was weird.